Hey what is up guys my name is Rahul and back again with another interesting challenge so the name of the challenge is who are you of the vague exploitation category so the description says that let me in let me in so let's open it up in new tab it says who are you only people who use the official pico browser are allowed on the site so let us give it the official pico browser so let me turn on my intercept refresh it let's take it to repeater forward and intercept is off so let's again send the request we get the response back only people who use the official pico browser are allowed on the site so let us change our user agent to pico browser now let's wait now i don't trust users visiting from another site so a referrer is one of the headers which tell us from which site the user is coming from so let's use referrer r e f e r r e r let's use the same host paste it and let's send it so this time uh, sorry it was r e r so let's send it sorry this site only worked in 2018 so i think we'll have to change the date as well so let's look up date header so we get the first one is from developer.mozilla.org so the way it is written is day name day month year hour minute and second so let's just copy it paste and let's change it to 2018 send it say now it says that i don't trust users who can be tracked so there is a interesting header it is called dnt means do not track so it takes in three values either zero which means you can track me one which you cannot track me and null which means do whatever you want so this is it the website this website is only for people from sweden all right so i had a hard time figuring it out but towards the end the header was x x forwarded for it tells us from which website or ip is this connection coming from so for identifying the originating ip address for client connecting the web server through an http proxy or load balancer so let's um, we want sweden's ip so sweden ip address so let's copy it let's copy any one so i have copied 88.206.229.93 so you are in sweden but you don't speak swedish so i think with this time we'll have to change the language so the accepted language header tells us which you which language do we accept so it tells us en us means united states english so let's change it to sweden web browser language identification codes all right so sweden or swedish is svsv so what we'll be doing is we'll be typing in svsv and let's leave sv over here and guys this is the flag for challenge pico ctf http headers are very cool much wow and the strange text so thank you guys this is it for the video i hope you liked it if you did like it please press on the like button and subscribe to my channel thank you